Hi there, and thank you for joining us here at Philip Capital's Market Watch. I'm Phil Gunn, Senior Sales Manager from Philip Nova. In this episode, I'll be giving an update on the inflation figures and the US Federal Reserve's outlook on interest rates. In other news, gold prices have made significant correction and prices have been rallying in recent weeks. How will gold perform going to 2023? Inflation is on the rise globally. Eurozone's latest figure is at 10.7% and UK's is at 10.1%. The Consumer Price Index CPI, a popular measure of the US inflation. The CPI reading for October is 7.7% year on year. It has been on the rise since June last year and the pace of the increase is relatively fast. Recent months have proven that the pace of increase has slowed down, which is a required precursor for inflation rate to fall. This is what the Federal Reserve essentially hopes for. The aggressive rate hikes they have initiated in recent FOMC meetings are targeted to increase the cost of living to discourage spending in order to achieve an overall drop in price of goods and services. This enforcement has resulted in the appreciation of the US dollar. Therefore, if inflation remains high, it is likely for the Federal Reserve to continue to hike interest rates until they get hold of the inflation situation. Unfortunately, that remains to be seen and inflation remains high. The Fed has been aggressively raising interest rates by 75 basis points each time. Currently, it is at 4%. The Fed has been open with their interest rate policies and have delivered on what they have projected so far. More rate hikes are expected as we step into 2023, but probably at a slower rate. It is expected for the Fed to raise interest rates to 4.75% as such, there is still some room for rate hikes. There has also been talks of a potential reversal of rate hikes. If the Fed does indeed put a pause on rate hikes momentarily, we will expect to see some relief on the downside pressure of gold prices. After inflation has stabilized in the future, the Fed could possibly start to roll out rate reductions. That being said, we could be looking at the final stage of gold prices reaching bottom in 2023 or earlier in this scenario. Jumping into the arena of demand and supply, the central banks are one of the biggest market players, since they have the biggest capacity to do. Global central bank purchases leapt to almost 400 tons in quarter 3 2022, an all-time quarterly record. This lifts year-to-date net purchases to 673 tons. From the chart, we can see that this surpasses the annual total purchases every year. This can also be seen in the recent rise in gold prices as central banks accumulate their gold reserves. The offloading of bullion by ETF's exchange-traded fund help push gold prices down 8% in the third quarter. This fall in price stipulated demand for jewelry, the World Gold Council said. Looking ahead, the central bank's buying and retail investment remains strong. Jewelry demand will most likely continue to perform strongly in regions such as India and Southeast Asia. This is the continuous daily chart for COMEX Gold Futures from TradingView.com. Prices were at their peak March 2022 and have been steadily on a decline until now. It is notable that this coincides with the implementation of the Fed's rate hike policy and quantitative tightening. We can see that price level 1630 has been tested three times and did not break, making it a strong support for gold. A resistance trend line is also drawn where crossing it indicates the first hint of reversal, which may or may not break. The 40 days moving average crossover is also observed, which is a good line to buy on dips if prices come back to retest. Resistance levels on the upside are 1736, 1770, and 1818 for target considerations. The temp support level is at 1700, coinciding with the big round figure. Philip Nova offers microcomex gold futures contracts. Promotional rate is as low as US $1.50 until the end of the year. Trading microcomex gold futures allows you to trade both directions of the market. You can choose to short sell if the market undergoes a correction phase using micro futures contracts on Philip Nova. You can trade these micro futures contracts with free market access and no platform fee. So sign up for a free live trading account now. It takes only a few minutes using your SingPass account. There's absolutely no minimum deposit required. And that's all for Philip Capital's Market Watch. Do remember to like and follow us on social media and subscribe to us on YouTube. Also, tell us what you think. How would the gold market fare in 2023? Leave your comments. Thanks for joining us, and we will see you soon.